complete freedom from drug, alcohol, or sexual addictions, financial needs such as the church, I mean such as a job. I wrote down all these things just thinking about the clothes here and about you. And I don't know if this relates to any of you in this room, but I am here to tell you people today, this is your moment. This is your time. And if you have a true need that you want God from heaven to bless and anoint you in, whatever it is, whether it's on this list or not, this is your moment. This is your time. I stopped at the door. It was a moment that changed my life. And I'm asking you to stop at this door. Don't leave this church without coming forward and having faith. Just, you know, Jesus just wants simple faith. It's just simple. It's nothing. But he says that where two or more are gathered together, all things are possible. Amen. So I'm going to believe unto him as he did for me, because I know better than anyone else in this room. In fact, I'm worse than most of you. I'll be the first to tell you that. I'm the least of men. But if God in his mercy would do things like that for me, he most definitely loves you just as much as he loves me. And he is able and willing to do these things. So in closing, I don't know, who in this church has been uh, asked who, who can pray for others? I'd like to ask those that, that Pastor Barbara Cindy uh, has come forward to pray. Would you mind coming up, whoever you are? I want to be sensitive to this unto the Lord. But I'd like you to come up. I'd like you to come up here. And this is your moment, people. 